Okay, this is Colwyn. Um, I am not ready to talk about the last four months yet. I have done several, several videos and stuff, and I'm going to edit things together, and I got my road trip video and just crap load of footage. But I just wanted to put up a video, finally, to say, yeah, I'm alive. I'm back in California. I got my room all set back up again. I'm still talking to my friend. I'm still talking to Laura. We're still getting along. There's, yes, some animosity right now. There's some hurt feelings and whatnot right now. Not ready to talk about it right now. All right. Shooting this on my cell phone right now, and it's... Well, not too bad of video. I might do it more often. I just wanted to put up a real quick random thought. I'm sitting here watching Doctor Who, which seems to be the only thing left I can watch anymore. Um, I smiled at that. That's funny. And I see a Target commercial for Star Wars, and they played some footage of people walking down the street. Humming the the Imperial March and this and then Star Wars has become even more commercialized and more pop culture -y than when Episode One came out. Everybody watches Star Wars now, and there used to be a time that being a Star Wars fan was oh God, you're a Star Wars fan? What a nerd! F you, I like it. You know, it, it set me apart. I think that was the cool thing about a lot of the nerd culture, you know? The anime culture, the Transformers culture, the, the Star Wars culture, Star Trek. Star Trek is still niche. Not everybody watches Star Trek, okay? But Star Wars is just, everybody watches it. It's, 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 it's hipster. I was liking Star Wars before everyone else liked Star Wars. You know, how many times do I see that phrase on, on message boards and stuff like this, you know? I, I'm on the 4chan toy section and, you know, people are talking about this toy and that toy. It's like, oh, well, I like that toy before it was cool to like that toy. And in some ways, that's part of what I feel is important about the nerd culture, you know? I'm liking this because nobody else likes it. Does that make any sense? Probably not. Oh, well. <sighs> what else do I want to talk about? Mm. I'm not sure if I'm going to start doing toy reviews on this channel. Or if I'm going to start and try and get my old Talkeray channel working again. But I just want to show these off real quick. This is Figma. Crap, what was her name again? Pula? I don't think that's her name. Oh, okay, Mommy Toma. Mommy? Homeo. Funny story about this figure. I'm going to do a proper review of it later on, but this is one of the figures that both me and Laura agreed was really cool. It's a cute blonde girl that dual wields flintlock rifles. And she's got some really pretty rifles. So that's that's a sword from another random figure. Get in there. Yeah, this cell phone camera may not be very good. I'm gonna figure someone else out. Well, a long time ago before I decided to move up north, the plan was I was going to buy two of these. Send one to her, keep one for myself. This is Figma. She's much more into Nendoroids. Which is why I'm going to be sending her this. The Nendroid version of Mami Tomoyo. 
Mommy Tome. Mommy Tome. That is just freaking adorable looking crap. Now that I see them side by side, I'm tempted to keep it. I'm not going to. So getting another one of these for myself might be kind of cool. They, they do look, wow, they look good together. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to wrap it. I'm going to <coughs> set my phone to upload this video. Then head off to Walmart to get some food and stuffs. And you know what? I might just say bleep it all and stick with one YouTube channel and start uploading my toy reviews to this channel. It'll give me something to upload. It'll give you guys something to watch. Maybe I can get back to my, my, my toy review, toy channel, Cockery channel was nice. It wasn't the greatest, but I had some, some subscribers and I had a couple of high ranking videos. Oh, maybe I'll reference you guys back to that. Thing about that channel is, is somehow a virus got attached to my Google account, and I'm not sure how much my Google account affected my YouTube account because I always want to do this. Damn it, YouTube! Wait! No, what was it? Fuck, I, I butchered it. Fuck it all. There was some guy that got pissed off by the whole Google YouTube password thing a long time ago, and I just thought that was freaking hilarious. He, he did it much better because it was much more off the cuff. You really believed he was violently angry about it. I am babbling. <laughs>